My father, each day, minute, hour, and second is your hand. Lord, we are here right now. Your power has come down. The heaven has opened. As we are going for this prophetic declaration, Lord, I pray, whatever thing that is still remaining, that will allow your name to be glorified, let your fire consumed. Amen. Whatever thing that is still remaining in our life that will cause shame, reproach, and embarrassment, Father, I pray right now by your name that's above every other name, let it be removed. Amen. My Father, my Lord, whatever thing that is remaining, that will glorify your name in our life, that will make our enemy to say, where is our God? Lord, I stand against that thing right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. My Father, my Lord, and my God, whatever garment that enemies have put on us, garment of limitation, garment of frustration, garment of struggling, garment of anxiety, if Father, you let your fire remove it Amen. now. Amen. My Lord, and my God, I pray for every faithful members of the New Life in Christ ministry, those who are here and those who cannot come today. My Father, let the fire of this prayer, the fire of praise, uh, 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 praise and worship, Lord, let it rub them where they are in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Blessed be the Holy Name. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Holy Spirit, over to you. Amen. Take control. Put Amen. your hands together in the presence of God and be seated. Put your hands together, please. I want you to open your hearts and your spirit to receive and whereby you're supposed to say amen please say a louder amen um i day before you is it friday on friday i was in nigeria in our church and they brought a man to me and the man came in came in when i was uh training the pastors and i look at the man then the man who brought him pastor dami who brought him said daddy I brought this man, he, he want to see you. And the Holy Spirit said to me, he didn't need to see you in the office. Then I pray, as I'm praying for the man, I saw that they wore him. He's a man wearing Buba and Shokoto. But underneath, he wears he, he wear skirts, women's skirts, dirty like anything. And the Lord began to minister to me to the man. Sir, I said, your glory can feed nation. But they are put on you in your father's house a skirt, skirt of frustration, skirt of not go, not reach where you are going to. The man bursts into tears. You can ask my wife, and I say two or three things to the man. He said, "I've been hearing it long time," and I told the man, "You have been hearing it. You will not hear it again." Praise the Lord. The man supposed to travel long time, not to stay in Nigeria, and the man was looking at me said. I've heard this when I was young. What they did is they searched for his future and they block his future in his father's house. I first asked him, are they masquerade altar in your father's house? He said, no, but if I altar. I said, from there, they finish you. I want to prophesy to someone's life today, either you believe it or not, Whatever thing that enemies have used to block your way, fire consuming. Amen. Every roadblock right now, the roadblock is being removed. Amen. Whatever thing that will cause shame, reproach, and embarrassment in your life, that thing is destroyed now. Amen. A couple came to me. They have been calling me from Nigeria. I didn't pick their phone. One of us, one of our member introduced them. They asked them to come. I think they, until they came to the New Life in Christ ministry in Nigeria, where we first went in March. As soon as they see me, and I pray for them, I prophesy to their life. They came on, 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 on Thursday to meet me in the church. And the sister, is, she's trusting God. She wanted to travel out. I didn't know them. I said, I didn't see your two, two legs in Nigeria that you have lifted. Why don't travel? begin to tell me the story. I say before I will come back again, the visa will come out. Lo and behold, they came on Thursday, he said, the visa that I've been trusting God for, he brought the passport, he brought the visa, he said exactly what you said, sir, it happened. He said, since me and my husband have an encounter with you, things begin to change in their life. I decree by the power of God that came down today, this morning, in Jesus' mighty name, 
either you believe or not, just say a louder amen. Whatever thing that I've been trusting God for, this week, receive it now. Amen. I said this week, receive it now. Amen. I said this week, receive it now. Amen. By the power in the blood of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Be seated. We have 10 plus 15. I won't. It won't be passed. You have dwell long on this mountain. I don't want to know your mountain, and I don't know where you have dwell, but I decree today, God Almighty will move you forward. Amen. Deuteronomy 1, verse 1 to 8. God himself came down to meet the Israelites and told them, you have dwell long on this moon. They did not know that they have dwell long, but their time has been wasted. Things, their artifact has been wasted, but God in it, it made mercy, spoke to them, arise, this is not the place I want you to be. And he told them, move forward. I pray whatever thing that is tying you and I done today, in the name of Jesus, that shit is cut off. Amen. I say it's cut off. Amen. I say it's cut off. Amen. You will move forward. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Verse 6 from verse 1. Deuteronomy 1. Deuteronomy 1. These are the words which Moses spoke to all Israel on this side of, of the Jericho, Jordan, in the wilderness, in the plain upside, so between Paran, Topel, Laban, Azebon, and this hub. Yes, it is 11 days' journey from Arab by way of Mount Syria to Kadesh Bane. Now it came to pass in the 14th year. In the eleventh month, on the first day of the month, that Moses spoke to the children of Israel according to all that the Lord had given him as a commandment to them. After he had killed Shion, king of the Amorite, who dwell Hezbon and Og, king of Bashan, who dwell at Hashiton in Edre. On this side of, the, of Jordan, in the land of Moab, Moses began to explain this law, saying, The Lord our God spoke to us in Herod, saying, You have dwelt long enough on this mountain. I want to stand up and pray. They mentioned some, of, they, they, they mentioned some kings in that place. The king, the causes hindrances and blockages. They don't allow thing to come, good thing to come to Israelites. And Moses said, after they have killed them, then the Lord said, you have the way long. You will say, Father. Father. Oh, is that how you can pray? Father. Don't look at, we have so many members. Don't look at maybe they come or they don't come. You are here today. If God wants to perform miracle, God did not wait for multitude. No, sir. Amen. Amen. I want to decree. Say, my father. My father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of whatever Jesus. Whatever things. Whatever things. That is in the, my progress. That is hindering my in progress. In my father's house. In my father's house. In my mother's house. In my mother's house. In my wife's house. In my husband's that house. That will allow me to move forward. That will not allow me to move forward. Father. Destroy them. Destroy them. Open your mouth and begin in to pray. In the name of Jesus. My father, my father. Whatsoever is hindering my movement in my father's house, in my mother's house, Whatever that will not allow me to move forward. Remove them now. Remove them now. My father, my Lord, remove them now. Every hindrance, every barrier, every blockage in the name of Jesus before me that will not allow me to move forward. Today, Lord, by your mercy, remove them, remove them, remove them, destroy them in the name of Jesus. Destroy them in the name of Jesus. Destroy them in the name of Jesus. The Lord, our God, spoke to us in the new life in Christ's ministry, saying, you have dwelt enough. Enough.
Ferrari. Né? Yes, sir. Want to. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Genesis thirty five to Jacob. Amen. Go up to Bethel and dwell there. We are the ark, the God that they have reached, but they have not been. Jesus, my father, my father, from my slumber, I arise, I move forward in the father, name of Jesus. I arise, I arise, Open your mouth I, arise and I move forward Open from my slumber in the name of Jesus. I arise, I, arise, I move for forward I in the name of God. I arise from my slumber. Oh, I, I arise I from my sleep. I move forward I in the name of Jesus. For your life. I move forward in the name of in Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. So shall it be. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. He says, Arise, go up to Bethel and dwell there, and make an altar there to God, who appeared to you when you fell from the face of Esau, your brother. What next? And Jacob says to his household, and to all, all with him, put away the foreign God that are among you. Purify yourself and change your garment. That's the prayer. God also told Gideon. Gideon said, why is the miracle of God? Where are the things that our forefather told us? God said, go and destroy the altar in your father's house. Say, my father. My father. I cannot hear you. Say, my father. My father. Every altar. Every altar. In my father's house. In my father's house. In my mother's house. In my mother's house. In my mother's house. Stopping my progress. They're stopping my progress. I destroy I them. Destroy them now. Your and begin to pray. In the name. Jesus, my father, my father, I destroy no every altar destroy in my father's house, kind of in my mother's house, they stop in my progress. progress. I destroy them now, I destroy them now, every altar, walking against my progress. I destroy you now, I destroy you now, in the name destroy of Jesus. Every altar destroy in my father's house, now. in my mother's house, destroy I, them they stop in my progress. Every I destroy you now, altar. every satanic altar, in every demonic house. altar, in my father's house, in my mother's house, I destroy them tonight, in the name of Jesus. I destroy them.
them today. I destroy you. I destroy you by fire in the name of God. I destroy you today by fire in the name of God. Yes, this them Every demonic altar, every satanic altar of my father's house, of my mother's house, hindering my progress. I destroy you. Let them be destroyed. They destroy by fire in the name of Jesus. We pray. Amen. When the man need and I begin to prophesize into his life, I say, sir, the Lord asked me to tell you, beware of battle of women. <laughs> what did he say, man? <laughs> I said, beware of women battle. <laughs> the man looked down in look up. Is it true, man? He said, you say the truth, man. And I told her, a woman is about to go for you. He said, Daddy has gone last week. His wife is the one, she's the one blocking her way. Then when she said that, I said, Sir, not only her, you marry more than two wives, and they are giving them to you in the realm of the spirit. What did he say, ma? He said, It is true. They are giving him wife from the realm of the spirit. I want you to pray. Then I said to the man to pray a prayer in Yoruba that the battle of sexual intercourse. You may not understand it, but I will pray it for you. Olua that's me, you will hear that prayer. The battle of men and women. Say it. Say it. The battle of sexual intercourse. Uh -huh. The battle of he loves, he loves. Sweat, the battle of sweat to sweat. Amen. 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 I told the man, I said, they used to take your sweat into the realm of the spirit. Whenever he sweat on the woman, they take it to the spirit realm. I want you to decree, say my father. My father. Say my father. My father. Say my father. My father. Whoever it is. Whoever it is. Say My sibling, where whoever it is, be it my siblings, my family, oh, men or women, old or young. Oh, where's your Father, life? where's their life in the name of Jesus? Where's them? Where's them? Where's them? Where's their life? Where's their life in the name of Jesus? Whosoever is standing against, against my progress, as an Father, enemy where's their life in the name of Jesus? Father, where's their life? Oh, where's their life in the name of Jesus? Where's begin them? to pray, where's begin them? to pray, begin them? to pray, where's begin them? to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray. standing against where's my progress? Life? Who's where's so their ever, life? Whosoever, 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 whosoever it is. Standing against my progress. Standing whoever against standing the progress against of progress, the new life in Christ ministry. Against my progress, Let against their progress life be wasted. Father, where's their life be wasted? Let their life be wasted. 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 Where's their life? Where's their life? In the name of Jesus. Any man or woman. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I will sing this in Yoruba. Pardon me. Because the Lord asked me to prophesy. It has been a while that we do this. And I will, I will say it in English. Koto dori mi koduro. Koto dori mi kodokun. Before he gets to me, let me stop. Before he gets to me, let me come to an end. The causes of my family, before he gets to me, must come to an end. Before I will reach my turn, let it destroy. Amen. Before I will reach my turn, let it stop. Amen. Every battle. Amen. Every problem. Amen. Every calamity. Amen. That used to happen to them mm -hmm. in my father's house. Amen. Before it will reach my turn, let it destroy. Amen. They said to Elizabeth and Zachariah, there is nobody bear this name in our family. But John is different. Say, I'm a difference. I'm different. Say, my father. My father. Say, my father. My father. Every calamity. Every calamity. Every battle. Every battle. That used to face my knowledge. That used to face my knowledge. Before we reach my turn. Before we reach my turn. Let them catch fire. Let them catch fire. In the name of Jesus. 
get fire. Every calamity, hey, good every day, problem, day, every causes of my father's hey, house, day, every causes of my mother's house, go to me, before he reach my toilet, let it be destroyed. Let it stop before he reach my toilet. I reject them over my life. I reject them over my children. I reject them over my children. I reject them over my husband. I reject them over my life. I reject them over my children. We reject them over our grandchildren. We reject them over this church. I reject them over your mother and pray. Every causes of my father's house to my mother's house that used to destroy them before he reached my tongue, let yes, it be destroyed. Let it stop. 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 In the in name of Jesus. Jesus, let we pray. Amen. Pray this in Psalm 63, verse 9 and 10. Pray this. There's an enemy like friends, and there's a friends like enemy. You, you hear about the man who came a month ago now and he destroyed his wife, beating his wife to death. You are hearing it? Did you hear it? Amen. Whoever determined to kill you, in the name of Jesus Christ, will kill himself. Amen. Any satanic agent, any satanic agent, I think the minister said it. For those that came down with the devil, any satanic agent mm. assigned against you to Jesus. destroy you, they will kill themselves. Amen. I want us to read it together. If we can read it, then we turn it to prayer. What did he say? But, but those, those who, who seek, seek my life to destroy it shall go into the lower part of the earth. earth. They, they shall, shall fall, fall by, by the sword. sword. They, they shall, shall be a portion for, for jackals. jackals. Go and ask Saul. Go and ask Goliath. Go and ask Aethiophel. Uh, 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 when they pursue David's life, they die by their own sword. They die before David. Say, my father! My father! Is that how you can pray? My Say, father! My father! Those who seek my life to destroy! Those who seek my life to destroy! Before they break! Before they break! Let them declare their victory! Let them declare Open your their mouth and begin to pray! Let In them the declare name their victory! Jesus! Oh Lord my God! Those who seek after my life! To destroy it before they to break. Destroy. Let the obituary be declared Let in the name of Jesus. Obituary. Let them announce the obituary. Let, Let the, them announce the, the obituary. Let the obituary be announced. Yes, those who seek so after my life, pray. those who seek after my By children's life, those who seek Jesus. after my husband's life to destroy it before they break. Let the obituary be announced in the name of Jesus. Let them announce all the obituary. Let them go down into the lower parts of the earth. They shall go down to the lower part of the earth. Let everyone announce their obituary in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord my God, fight my battle. Whosoever, whatsoever. Whosoever, whatsoever. Lord, that will allow your name to be glorified in my life. Those who want to destroy the power of God in my life. Those who want to destroy your plan for my life. Lord, let the obituary be announced. Lord, let the obituary be announced in the name of Jesus. Let them go into the lower part of the earth. Yes, Lord. Let them announce the obituary in the name of Jesus. Those who want to destroy the work of God. Those who want to destroy the work of God. In my life, oh God. In my life, oh Lord. In my family, in my home, in the life of my children. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Pray this for yourself. I have only five minutes more. Lepticus 26 verse 9 to 13 is your own personal declaration. Then I will the same. Lepticus 26 verse 4 to 6. I will use it to declare in your life. I pray for someone here. For the power that came down today. Before the end of this week, in the name that of door, Jesus, I declare it open. Amen. A sister came here, brother, that they can testify. One single you barren. In the morning, he sat there. When we are praising, she was weeping. When we are praying, she was crying. And I was moving the spirit. I came to the sister here, here. I said, the Lord said to me that before the end of today, he will turn this weeping into dancing. So I say, wipe your, I, I, I think I took a tissue and anointing oil. I wipe 
the way the tears and anoint our eyes. Bef when we finish, before I rush to my office, is it true, sir? What is crying for? What she have been expecting before she got to Morris? They just call her and give her the good news. I hear by, by the power in the name of Jesus. In the name Someone of Jesus. that is here knocking the door of good news before the end of this week. That door is open. Amen. 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 Listen to me. A prophet said to a sister, where is your husband? Only I don't have husband. And the man said, what of the one by your side? That week, the husband show up. I pray whereby you have lost hope in the name of Jesus by this prophetic declaration, your hope will arise. Amen. The Lord God Almighty will visit us. Amen. He will surprise us. Amen. He will answer our prayer. Amen. He will attend to our case. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's go. What did he say? Lepticus 26, verse 9. Verse 9 to 13. For I will look on you favorably and make me fruitful. Amen. Multiply me and confirm his covenant with me. Amen. I shall, I shall eat, eat the old harvest and, and clear out the old because, because of, the of the new. Amen. I will set my tabernacle among you Amen. and my soul shall not, not abhor you. Amen. I will I walk among you, you. Amen. and I'll be, be your God. Amen. And you shall be my people. Amen. I am the Lord your God who brought, brought you out of the land of Egypt that, that you shall not be their slave. slave. I pray you will not be a slave. Amen. You will not be a slave for money. Amen. You will not be a slave for your children. Amen. You will not be a slave for your friend. Amen. You will not be a, a, a slave for your for, 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 for your maid. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Not to be, I have broken, broken the, the bands, bands of your yoke, yoke and made you walk upright. upright. Give me that verse 9. I want us to decree, say, my father. My father. As we enter into the new week. As we enter into the new week. Look into me look unto Open me your favorably. mouth and begin to pray. Father, I will my father, look for my you, Lord, as we enter into this new week, Lord. Father, and look unto me favorably. Look unto my children favorably. Look unto my husband favorably. Look unto my family favorably. In the name of Jesus. As we enter this new week, this new month, in the name of Jesus. Look into me Lord, favorably. Look unto me and my family favorably. Look into me favorably. Jesus. Look unto the new life. Open your mouth and pray. In the name of Jesus. Look as you unto mean us it. favorably. In Look the name into of me Jesus. favorably. Look unto me favorably. Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. The same Lepticus 26, verse 5 and 6. Just be saying a louder amen. 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 Your treasure shall last in the time of vintage. Amen. And the vintage shall last in the time of sowing. Amen. You shall eat your bread to the full. Amen. And dwell in your land safely. Amen. I will give peace in this land. Amen. Anywhere you are going to from now, peace of God will rule your life. Amen. Whosoever you are dealing with or they are dealing with you, they will have peace with you. Amen. Your children, you will have a peace with you. Amen. Your colleagues, peace. Amen. At your work, peace. Amen. When you are sleeping, please. Amen. In your dream, peace. Amen. Round about, peace. Amen. The Lord will take away anxiety. Amen. And give you peace. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And you shall lie down. Amen. From today, no more bad dreams. Amen. No more satanic dreams. Amen. No more nightmare. Amen. And now we make you afraid. Amen. In every area that you so afraid, we cancel it. Amen. By the word of God, we cancel it. Amen. And we raise the land of evil beasts. Amen. And the sword will not go to you, your land. Amen. I pray those who will be harassing you, the Lord will harass them. Amen. Whosoever will harass you, the Lord will harass them. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Verse 7 in Jesus' wonderful mighty name. Amen. I decree you, you will chase your enemies. Amen. 
Amen. They shall fall by their sword. Amen. Before you. Amen. Your enemy will fall by their sword. Amen. The enemies of the new life in Christ will fall by their sword. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Five of you shall chase a hundred. Amen. And a hundred of you shall put ten thousand to fight. Amen. Your enemy shall fall. Amen. By your sword before you. Amen. And sword fall before David. Whosoever stand against us and enemy, they will fall before you. Amen. I declare they will fall before you. Amen. As you are going right now, go into the you are going into the world. Amen. Go and meet your helper. Amen. The people that God has provided down for you, go and meet them. Amen. He said to Elijah, see, I provide for you a widow. widow. I pray, whoever that God has provided for you, they will meet with you. Amen. They will release your life. Amen. Esau is coming to destroy Jacob. The moment he met Jacob, he embraced him. Yes. Whatever thing that want to cause his havoc in your life, right now as you are going out, they will embrace you. Amen. They will say to you. Amen. They will speak of you. Amen. Everyone in this house, including me, whatever door we are knocking, whatever thing that we have been asking God for, the by the Jesus. corporate anointing in the house today, the before Jesus. seven days, receive your testimony. Amen. Shall it be? Amen. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Put your hands together, be seated. If you came late to this out today, you are not here, drop your offering and your tithe. Please do so very quickly. Do so very quickly. We have our Lua Dasimi. Don't forget we have an assignment. I brought the water again. We have enough water now. But I want every one of you mark that day down. On the 11th of, of, of May, it's our Ulua Dasimi, and we have a prophetic assignment. Could God ask me to give every one of you the water that I brought from, from the mountain? And our evangelists will be here with us. Please, every member of this church, either you hear English or not, and Yoruba or not, be part of that prophetic Uluwa Dasimi. The April has gone. We want to enter into May, June, July, August. Another four months. Our life will never remain the same. I promise you and I told you that God said before the end of this year that none of the members of this church will weep. And God has been transformed people's life. I've been hearing testimony here and there. I've been hearing testimony. People, garments have been changed. Amen. Please don't be left out. Your own time will come. Amen. I say your own time will come. Amen. I say your own time will come. Amen. In Jesus' name. Offering time. If you came late, you are not yet dropped your offering and your tithe, please do so. Father, Lord, we say thank you, Lord. Thank you for the offering and the tithe, and thank you, Lord, for the opportunity to be able to give, Lord. Father, Lord, we present this tithe and offering unto you. Lord, let it be acceptable, oh Lord. For the souls that deserve to give and they don't have, Father, Lord, we pray, oh Lord, grant them a breakthrough, oh Lord. Father, Lord, we key into this offering, oh Lord that every evil 
reoccurrence in any of our family, in any of our lineage. Father, with this seed, O oh Lord, let it be broken, O oh Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus. And let this offering, O oh Lord, be acceptable. And let us be able to use it for the propagation of your work. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Let somebody shout hallelujah. Let's stand up and share the grace together in fellowship. Please, um, can you change the light? Let some people that are not here last week, let them see it. One woman, yes. So, please, we, that is the second phase. Everyone that have promised or pledged one way or the other, they are coming first week in May. Is it? Yes, first week in May to finish their job. Uh, you know, they are not, they, there is an agreement we signed for them before June. Please, if you pledge or you promise us one way or the other, um, I think I send some of our members, our sisters and brothers out to be calling people. We are not calling you to embarrass you, please. We are just calling you to remind you so that we, should, we will meet up to our target and our agreement with them. It will not be okay when they finish their job. What we promise them, they will not be able to do it. Please, um, if you know that you promise us one way or the other and they are calling you, we are not calling to beg for money. We are not calling to embarrass you. We are just calling to remind you, please and please, let's redeem it so that we can settle them. I think when they will come now, they are going to change the the box, um, the drummer boots. We are not going to use that one again. The the choir is not going to use all this um, standing microphone again. Then there are a lot of things. Our speakers they are going to rearrange it for us. Please and please. It shall be well with you, and God will bless you. If you look at the children at the youth church there, we spend nothing less than 6,000 pounds there. And if you look at the members, the number of the people coming to the house, you yourself will wonder, how are they doing it? They just finished painting the place, and after finishing, they, are, they were, we want to, we want to paint the old house for our convention. Please and please, if you pledge, redeem your pledge, God will bless you and God will attend to your case. It shall be well with you in Jesus' name. Shall we share the grace together in fellowship? The grace of the Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, or the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with me right now and forevermore. Amen. Surely his goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. And if you have done for us before, and you're still led by the Holy Spirit to do more, please don't, don't, don't hesitate. God bless you. It shall be well with you all. In Jesus' name.